Hello everybody and welcome to part 3 of episode 2, trial 2. We have just finished the first day of trial. We will now begin our second day of investigation and possibly finish this. Yes, we will save. And we will overwrite. And we will now backspace. Alright, this itself should only take about 30, 30 minutes. Attention center, producer. Oh, hello, I didn't expect anyone to be in such a bad place as this. It's really quite moving. No, you stick your up with that. No, 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 something. Unfortunately, there is nothing I want to be at. Haven't you done enough questioning, Spike yet? Please, you're scaring the security guard. Oh, I want to see what you have for me, then. About the man who says, you know, tell me. Can you tell me about him? Where is he? Come on. No, I have that. Mm. Why did you place a wiretap on your phone? Oh, when you say it like that, so, so of course it's not. Uh, tapping people's phones is a crime, this man. It's a shame the U.S. government did. I suppose you're right now, logical. Mm, creep. Say, why are you so angry? I mean, you don't look like a bad person. Let's start the farm, please. Hey, guess what? Actually, uh, I really hate you guys, but get lost if you want my carpet. Thanks, I noticed. Let's go see if we can find anybody else. Ah, oh, welcome, sir. Quite the performance today, if I dare say so. Oh, thanks. Uh, sorry for putting on spot like that. No, 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 sorry. Your efforts today can only get worse reputation. Uh, rap. Yes, our reputation was swell as the hotel where the murderer used the wiretaps. You can charge a premium for the room, of course. He'll stop you get your business first. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This man hasn't been charged with murder. I, I too, will become famous. The dog boy brought the murderer iced coffee. Oh, I don't feel like ripping. So, you're on a guest food? I wanted to ask you, the man who's with me. Ah, yes. You struck me as a real lady killer for partner. So, see, I know from where I saw him. So, he and I are the same. We both care the same age. If you had a photo of that man, I'm quite sure I could identify him. It's a photo. Do what? I don't remember where I have to meet the other guy, so... Just give me a watch. Oh. I was wasting our time here. Huh, looks like Chris pretty good. Wait a second. Wasn't there a giant painting on this wall? Yeah, yeah, there's a painting of fishermen. Isn't it? It's very memorable. Wait, what's this old photo there too? I hear something. Geo six incident incident eight. Geo six incident. Uncertain. Oh, I think I have a feeling who that is. The photo lies on the desk. Yeah. He just looks like a douche. All right. I know all I need now.
take a look at this photo. That's him, Detective. Uh, I'm the lawyer here. Uh, I know that. I just wanted to say Detective Punch, you know how to... No, no, I don't. Without a doubt, that is the man who checked me with Mr. Murray. How about I write an affidavit saying that that's him? An affidavit? Yeah, I'll have him write it down. Oh, you sure on it? Yes, uh, I've always wanted to write an affidavit. I've heard such a... Just hurry up and write it. Uh, so it's my fault, you know. You can... Who is this man? Have a look at this. Look, I've, I've said several times, I'm not telling you. Where did you? Uh, this is him, isn't it? One, two, one, five. It, it is him. This is the man who stayed in your hotel room the night of the murder. No, that, no, that's not right. Do you have proof of him? Yeah, proof. Show me proof. That's why we have the affidavit. Could you have a look at this? What's that? The bellboy's affidavit. It tells us everything he saw, such as the man who checked in you checked in with. Who was most definitely this guy. No use in playing dumb. If you don't talk, I'm taking this input to the What? Even though he should have been witness the murder. Your little friends are missing, I'm sure. They have a field day with his reputation. Ooh, it's fine, I'll talk. You 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 win, lawyer. Here. Now, tell me about the main boy. That man, he's my boss, Red White, the president of the information gathering conglomerate, Blue Corp. Those are three words that should never go together. Information gathering con conglomerate. That's basically words for this is a spy agency. Let's see what we got. Red White. Information gathering. Well, I suppose you could call it a detective agency. Hmm. So this is the man that was with you the night of murder. I'm I'm scared to talk. I don't want to end up like that. It's, it's okay. I'll just ask Mr. Ransom. Can you tell me where Blue Corp is located? Welcome. Please first you with the title of your person. What the? Your name. What's your name? I was just inquirably asking the title that you go by. Uh, right. Phoenix Wright. Mr. Wright, is it? Right, I see. Splendiferous. Perhaps I have intimidated you with my giant test vocabulary. There's a callback. Uh. I'm Red White, CEO of Blue Corp. You know, corporate expansion official. My business dealings bring me into contact with the elite of the elite, so I'm afraid I'm not used to conversing with the word elite talent. Hmm, let me guess, you are a tiny fresh out of law school, you're not that ceiling explanation for why you come to meet me like this. No matter, so what business does a mighty lawyer have with men such as myself? On the night of murder, on the murder, were you in April Bay's hotel room? Don't worry, be happy. Still, Mr. White, the hotel bellboy has stated on the record that he does remember you very clearly. No matter, the bellboy can't say what he pleases. I still want to talk to you. If you want me to speak, put me on the witness stand. Although I doubt you'd be capable of doing that. Oh, oh, oh. the police, the courts, to me they are mere toys. Play things for my amusement. Miss Bay doesn't play flute, but she's not correct. She was my secretary. What a shock it was to hear what she has done. You mean what she has said? You mean the wiretap? Indeed, she has paid attention to phones. Tapping them is not to no job description. She does gather information for us as part of our duty, but I assure you we do not condone illegal methods. It's inevitable that she would do this. Oh, uh, there's something that's bothering me. Yes, what that might be. That big painting on the wall over there. You know, I've actually seen that painting before. Oh, just yesterday, really. Your point being... My point is simple, uh, rather, my question is simple. Why is that painting hanging on your wall? Mr. Wrong, was it? Right. It appears you do not fully grasp his attention. I asking, who are you? A, a lawyer? No, my feeble friend. A mere lawyer worth nothing. Still except nada. Just like that. Sorry, excuse my attorney. Grody, Burgo. What? Uh, uh. 
Uh, Bob is the lawyer. What will you do? Charge my salt, charge away. I welcome it for you. It's for it is you who will be found guilty. What? Need my expertise in the police, the courts, they all do my bidding. I don't expect you to understand there's a world beyond the campus. No. You came here from Grody Bay, is that the truth? Mr. Grossberg, she asked. Then you must ask him why is that there's this painting of his hangs. Perhaps then he will tell you. Perhaps he will explain how American live purely for personal profit. Go now, skedaddle. There is nothing more to discuss. Would you be kind enough to cease your name chattering and vacate the premises? Let me put in language here to our church what I said. Shut up and get out! I have nothing more to say. Alright, fine! Huh? Um, jump into your house, man! Oh, you! What's wrong? You look like so pensive, like an old man at the end of the Oh, that's you know, yeah, I was just thinking about this whole bit. She came to see the trial? Yeah, she yes, I did. Something was bothering me all last night. You see, I could with the sleep. Really? What was that? Well, you see, it's just me, it's just that poor girl. Poor, I owe you my thanks, girl. I don't know what I've done. Hey, poor girl, poor girl. So I paid Blue Corp visit. Oh, I see. Miss Grossberg, I have to admit, something has been bothering me. Oh, so, uh, you see, it's just... I thought that was strange. She was living here. I'm a friend of the school but you accused of killing her. I just realized that you and the Colonel Grossberg, you and Mr. He's, uh, Mr. Wright has Mr. White has something I he doesn't black man. I thought I thought they were talking about Mr. Grossberg, so there was a giant pin right there on the other day, was there not? The one you said you had no intention of parting with? Well I saw it today. It was in the CEO's office at Blue Corp, Red White's office. So, so, so you know, so I suppose I should have guessed you. It is a lot. Mr. Grisberg, tell me what happened. Red White is a man who makes his living through intimidation. Blue Corp is a company that excels at finding people's weaknesses. I'm, I've been paying them for 15 years now. All because of the DL6 incident, you have guessed the name. Yes, you like I cannot stand to give it much. White would have destroyed me if I did. It's hard for me to tell you this, my boy, but arresting Red, Red White will be nigh impossible. Possible? What? He has information on everyone. It gives him an iron grip. He owes judges, attorneys, prosecutors, police, and politicians. What? They are found unable to harm to themselves and therefore to him. Don't look at me like that. What you see is destined for them the weight of many years. I need a drink. What is the DL6 incident? The DL6 is nothing more than a certain cut the police gave the case. It was 15 years ago now. I received a request from the medium, a spirit medium. A medium. My name was Misty Faye. Faye. That's just my drink, don't worry. You know, recording three, uh, an hour and a half long episode. Indeed, she was Misty Mia's man. She may have been investigating murder at the behest of the quest of police, and she failed. As a result, the police called her a fraud. Why were you blackmailed over this, Mr. Grossberg? The DLC is so at the time. It made sense. It let people go, but one person found out I, I told him. You, you told White? He offered me riches. White just goes wild. Alright, well, let's go over to the bank hill offices, which will be quickly to the right.
Well, a large duplex is this one here. Sure. I really haven't really beat myself, but it seems nice. Well, it's not really Stop that, your hot gay is giving you goosebumps. What's wrong? There's something to fix my face. Oh yeah, fix my eyes and my nose right now. Of course I should say me I think. It's okay to dodge my cosmetolic sense of humor. I will not think less of you. Mr. Wright, see that it's an article description of suicide politician. He was in Bez League Chief Government for seven one days. Work out leads to express very next day fixed on life and the Sutopia. Found this article on yourself. Mystia? She had a file filled with articles like this. Every one of them was labeled with a single word. White. Mr. Wright, I know what you did to the politician. You blackmailed him. You were blackmailing him. Blackmail? Not just him, I you were threatening and causing hunch. You were involved in all the suicide cases that needed to escape. This company's Sorry, I'm not sure. What a bizarre accusation, Mr. Wrong, I said. Doing now? Investigating me? No, 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 I think not. You should be searching for the one who... Wrong will be leaving now. Yes, sir. I'll turn to one there. Yes, sir. Mia was on the front of you. She was keeping tabs. For this reason, you had to wait to have in front. Then, Mia was murdered in all the documents about you mysteriously disappeared. So, the culprit would be, even a child could work it out, Mr. White. You did it. We won't be needing an escort from Mr. Wrong. Instead, please connect me to the public prosecutor's office. Of course, I'm on. White, that's you? What you Hello, Chief Prosecutor. I've changed my mind. I went to testify tomorrow. The Mia Fey case, I witnessed the matter. You see, and that's, that's a very important witness. I would like to testify. But why now? Quietude. I told you I changed my mind, didn't I? Oh, and what other thing? Send the police over here right away. The man is in front of me right here. He looks dazed, but could be fine. Are you even listening? The exec executioner, the hatchet man, the liquidator, the killer man. What? Mr. Wright, this is another one of those. Chief Prosecutor, I do not believe you are in a position to freely offer your opinions to me, correct? I'm telling you to send the police now. Did I not tell you, Mr. Wrong, you are a mere lawyer, as must miss me a hard day. I'll point the finger at you and you will be tried to see you. The case is as good as set no lawyer of any worth will offend you. I have friends of the local lawyers association, you see. You'll be given a lawyer so stupendously enough that they'll make even you look confident. <sighs> Detective Gubbs, you're reporting, sir. Ah, but. Harry Butt. Right, actually. Phoenix. My friend's name. Oh, right. Sorry, but Butts was that murder, right? Detective Gubbs, you. I present to you the man who killed Miss Mia Fay. What? Take this despicable human being into custody. Farewell, Mr. Wrong. I hate this man. I hate this man with all my life. I can't believe it's been a day since it's only been a day since the first trial. Oh, Maya. Great. Better let you out of detention. Just now, yes. It's all thanks to you. Uh, no, I'm afraid we switched places. What? You mean you. I explained what happened to Maya. I, I don't believe it. How many people does that man need to switch? Uh, well.
No, yeah, I like that. All right, leave it to me. Huh? I better get a new friend to pump up. Wait, hey, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. I'm get, it was a, no, wait, no, really, I was kidding. Thanks for coming out of my side. But, but, but I can't just sit here and do nothing. I gotta give that man a piece of my life. Just a piece. Okay. Then come to the trial tomorrow. Uh, okay, I'll be there. I'll show them a thing or two. Time to change. You have to come. come, come. Make the truth call for appearing to start with. Oh god, we're gonna need a part four? Alright, well I guess this is where this ep uh, part ends. We'll see you next part, which will be the final part of this episode. Yeah, it'll be Thursday for the last video. Alright, see ya.